All right, guys, right. Quick update. I'm just uh, doing a quick, this video here, just a quick video. I'm just going to give you a bit of a hint on what's coming up in the next few videos. I've got uh, well, quite a few things planned this coming see well, certainly over the next few months anyway. I'm going to be... Um, I'm going to be heading up Druridge Bay soon. Um, it's a big beach, it's a huge beach up in Northumberland. Um, we're going to be targeting flatties. There's going to be, I'm sure, there's going to be flounder. There's also the possibility, the possibility even, of um, some turbot and bass, although we'll see on that. But they're, they're the three main species that we're going to be looking at catching. Um, it's not going to be. It's not going to be um, heavy fishing, you know. I'll, I'll be taking the bass rod because the turbot aren't particularly big, you know. The they're only sort of size. They're not. They're not huge. But it's you know it's another one for the species hunt, and it's probably nine years since I last caught a turbot from the shore. So you know, so what? Been a while. Um, what's going to be planning some early season? lure fishing off the rocks even further up north into up into the borders of, of Scotland um, that's gonna involve acting like a mountain goat so it's gonna be quite hard going but me and, me and a mate of mine Simon hopefully if he can get time off work um, we'll be heading up there we're also, we're also gonna go up with Kirsty as well because Kirsty loves she loves it up there fishing there's um, there's a trip coming up at the end of April, me and Chris Churchill. This is this is the big one. This is like a long weekend up on the west coast of Scotland. And there's one particular fish that I've never caught, and I know Chris has never caught, that we're going to be targeting. Now, I can't honestly... Really, well, I don't think we're going to catch the target species. If we don't, there's nothing lost really. You know, it's it's the first time I've particularly fished for them. Certainly from the shore, um, so it's all a bit of a learning curve for us. But we're going to target skate, common skate. It's up past Oban where we're going. We'll, we'll be fishing into around 300 foot of water from the shore. Um, I do know that this skate there. I've seen, you know, I know people that have caught them. I've, I've got a friend of mine that he um, he's seen them hooked into, not landed, but he's seen them hooked into there. But there's also there's also a few other species that we're going to be looking at catching there. Um, conga, there's get plenty of conga up there. Um, hounds, smooth hounds, spur dogs, rays, different different rays, thornbacks, such. Um, but there's also apparently quite a lot of uh, wrasse there as well, so I will be taking the LRF gear, and we will be targeting, you know, down the edge, we'll be targeting the, the wrasse and the coley and the pollock, um, which, as you know, I love catching fish like that on the LRF. There's, um, there's going to be a few videos, obviously, in between. Um, we are, we will be going across to White Haven again for the Congo and the Rays. I do know there's one or two Rays starting to show over on the west coast over there now, so um, hopefully we'll get back out with Earl from Gone Fishing, um, make another video and hopefully it won't get as wet this time. I'll, you, mate, you're never going to live that one down. I'm never going to let you live that one down. Um, <laughs> so, you know, hopefully we'll get back out with Earl. Um, as far you know, that's over the next sort of up into the sort of beginning of May. Um, <clears throat> that's kind of what I've got planned at the moment. I'm sure there's going to be, um, like I say, there'll be other videos, you know, local videos as well that will be um, will be uh, recording. Um, one thing I was going to ask: if there's any particular videos that you would like me to record, or anything you'd like me to look into and do a video on. Please feel free to comment. Um, you know, I've, I'm slowly getting a, a good um, following. I've 50, 57 subscribers at the time of recording this. So, you know, I thank you all for that. Your support's really appreciated. Again, I will thank Earl because I know he's been uh, sharing my videos quite a lot and helping me. He's been giving me advice on, you know, 
how to how to promote videos as well, which really appreciate that. Um, that's about it, guys. Like I say, if, if there is anything you you do um, want me to look into, just comment down below, and I'll uh, I'll try and answer every uh, every comment that's posted as well. But once again, thanks for your support. Keep watching. Don't forget to hit the like button on my videos and share and subscribe. Thanks very much.